Sunday, April 2nd, 2017, and we're at WonderCon in Anaheim, California. And we're gonna see what we can see. Look at it! It's Evan Burst, What's cartoon going on, block. <laughs> Yeah, WonderCon 2017. We're doing Will Terrell here. We're doing it up, doing big things, big things popping. You know, walking the floor here in Artist Alley. Yeah, man, how you doing, little man? How you doing? I know how it is. Oh, he's tired. Oh no! How, how long have you been watching the channel? Um, oh god. Since, uh, since, since you were doing the, 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 the people sketching stuff. Oh, okay. So, it's been a while. Yeah. See, I think even before you moved here to California, I think I was, I was watching those videos. Aww. You know, I was like, every time I would, I would drive out, you know, like an hour drive, I would listen to those. How are you enjoying WonderCon so far? Uh, Alright, yeah, I've been talking to a lot, a lot of artists, uh, especially if they're doing uh, storyboarding. Oh, oh no, Emma, Emma's trying to be the cameraman. Oh no! <laughs> Uh, getting advice from them, you know, how, like, what their process is. Kind of, kind of basically what, what they're doing. Yeah. I'm, I'm basically living the Will Terrell life. <laughs> That's it. Oh, hey, Tanaro. How are you doing? You enjoying the show so far? I, I love it. How was class last week? I didn't make it. Oh, class was good. <laughs> I, get a, I got a lot of critiques and all that, so I'm going to apply it. Was it good critiques? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was fun. It was fun. It was, it was definitely... Uh, it was a good session. I think I follow you on Instagram. I follow you too oh. on YouTube. Oh, <laughs> I love her stuff. <laughs> Thank you. Look at Shelby Unicorn. So good. Thank you. How's the show been so far? It's been going okay. <laughs> <laughs> Those are good shows too. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> I'm here with Steven Silver. Hey! How's the show been? Good, yeah, it's been a good show. This has been a great area. I've been sold out since every day here. It's like oh, that's awesome. He's got a new book now. Yeah, doing really well. Just a lot, a lot of people coming saying that they got theirs and they're excited, you know, and reading through it. That's cool. Learn it. WonderCon, and I just put down a big chunk of change to buy a table for next year. No telling if I'll actually get the table though, because there's a waiting list. Uh, they, waiting list, and they kind of have to see if you're special enough to get a table. Hopefully I meet the criteria. I don't know. It's, I'm actually kind of nervous. I haven't done a big comic convention in a long time. The last time I did a Comic-Con show was like San Diego Comic-Con 2004. I did some of the Texas shows, but uh, not, nothing this big. <laughs> but I'm ready to I'm ready to take a chance. And I gotta go find my wife and baby. They're just here somewhere. Meeting up with some friends at, where are we, Red Robin?
talking to you. Well, it was, it was a pleasure. I will make sure to uh, send people to your channel. Uh, well, you know, I'll send them back to you. All so. right, that sounds good. <laughs> yeah. uh, thanks for uh, all the advice that you gave me. Yeah. Awesome Thank stuff. It was, it was great. great conversation. Mm. Mm. Well, that was a really fun show. I enjoyed it. It was kind of a last minute thing. I'm glad that I went. Uh, I got to meet a lot of fans and subscribers. Uh, I wish I'd caught more on video. Um, to everybody that stopped me and said hi, it was, it was good seeing you guys. I got to see a lot of my friends that had tables at the show. Uh, I saw Sean Bryant, uh, Steven Silver, my friend Doug from the Watts Atelier, Will Terry, who people are always confusing me for. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it was just, it was really good. It was a good show. And then afterwards, Amber Emmett and I got dinner with Brian and his family and met up with a couple of YouTube artists, um, Cynics, who was actually one of the first YouTubers I ever met when I first moved out here to California. Uh, Robert, he's a super sweet guy. <laughs> and then I met his friend, Ahmed Alduri, and I didn't realize that he, uh, his YouTube channel is something I've been following for a long time. I'm bummed because I've been working with a new video camera. It's a, a Canon PowerShot G7, and I keep covering up the mic. It's really annoying. I need to, like, put something where I won't cover it up. Uh, but I had some really good interviews with both Ahmed and, um, and Cynix and their friend Scott and had a little good, you know, good conversation, and it all got... The audio was just jacked on it. Same thing with meeting up with some of my subscribers at the show. A lot of the audio was just messed up, and so I couldn't use the footage really. So, yeah, it was a good show. I think Emmett enjoyed it. It kind of wore him out. He <laughs> There were a few times I had to, like, take him to a quiet corner and just mellow him out because it was too much just sensory overload, and I get like that. I can't imagine being one and a half almost and... You know, this is your first time experiencing it. It was funny when we were first walk, walking into the show, the, we were walking behind this person in a terrifying bunny costume. And the, the scary bunny had like blood and claws and all that stuff. And he turned around and he gave Emmett a little stuffed bunny and he didn't flinch at all. But we got to the actual show and you know, a few minutes later in Spider-Man, I tried to get Spider-Man to take a picture with Emmett and he started screaming at the top of his lungs. For some reason, Spider-Man scared him, but I'm sure he'll get over that. <laughs> I'm really excited about the idea of having a booth at WonderCon next year. Um, it's been a long time since I did shows, like really went all out with it. Uh, I did CTN a few times. But I never really like went all out with doing a whole booth setup. It was just kind of showing up with what I had. Um, it's a if you want to make money at a convention, though, you really gotta you gotta be kind of aggressive with it. You gotta plan it out, do good displays, good signage, and have plenty of product to sell, and just be organized about it. And that's uh, something I haven't been ready to do until now. Even though I'm busier than I've ever been, I'm excited about doing it. I guess that's it for tonight. Thanks for watching, and uh, keep smiling.